Anytime we do something new, it takes time to get used to it and really learn its benefits. Um, it's kind of like when we went from black and white cameras to color. Um, for the first year that color was out, I liked my black and white camera because I was used to looking at it. I could see the shadows and things. Um, I thought better, but once you started using, obviously, color, it, um, it was better. Um, this push rod works very well. The, the distance, the 160, 65 feet in there, um, most of the time is going to be completely sufficient. Um, my standard, unfortunately, at times, you know, due to, due to damage, I'm, I'm usually under 200 feet. So this is no different for me um, than working with my standard at the moment. I, I really think the three benefits. This D2B spring works better than the standard spring. I, I don't think there's going to be any doubt of that. It will work very well. I see no drawbacks to it. Two, the push rod. The jacket of it is much slicker, and I think will outlast the other older jackets. The, the camera head itself, I guess, would be the third benefit, considering a, if you're comparing it to the standard due to the size, because you can use technically one push rod now for um, anything from inch and a half, two inch, up to six inch. So the, the, the size of the camera head does not limit the amount of light. Um, from my experience, and uh, the only difference is, just like the standard, when you get in a larger line, you need to put the skids on it to, to rise it up and equal the light out. So, there's, it, it only has benefits, there's no drawbacks.